What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon X walkthrough. And yes, look at that, we got new threads and everything, look at that. And for some reason we're in Ambret Town. Oh yeah, we were capturing off screen and all that stuff. Yeah, forgot about that guys. Anywho, in our next adventure right here, we're going to be going straight to the next town, I believe. Now, again, I was capturing Pokemon off screen. Training my Pokemon just a little bit. Don't worry. I'm not training them too much just because I don't want them to evolve off screen and everything. I'm, I mean, many of you guys want to see that whole miracle of evolution and all that stuff. So, yeah, doing that for a little bit later. So, here we are back at Silage Town. And if you guys remember in our last episode, we won our second badge in the Kalos region. And now it is finally time to move on right here. So, we're going to be walking. Now, I didn't cross this area right here, Route 10. Because there are quite a few trainers, a lot of stuff that you can actually do here, a lot of Pokemon that you can actually find right here too, and in reality, this place right here, I'm actually going to go, well, I'm actually going to go here later on to capture more Pokemon. Uh, one Pokemon in particular that you can actually find here are Eevees, and if you guys want to complete a set of the Eeveelutions, this is the place to go because... You'll find a buttload of Eevees. The only thing is, you're going to have to have a lot of patience in trying to find it. Now, what I'm trying to do right here is I am trying to move this boulder this way. So, let's go right ahead and go down here, down here, and we're going to go right here, right here, and one more right here. Now, other Pokemon you can actually find right here, Howlucha. If you guys don't remember, it is the fighting slash fighting type Pokemon. Pokemon that Ash had, and then uh, Sigilyph, you can actually find them right here too. Don't worry guys, I will capture all these Pokemon off screen. Nickname them and then, you know, have them there, just in case and all that crud. And here we go, we found ourselves the TM73 Thunder Wave. A very important move, if you want to capture some Pokemon, slow down your opponents and all that crud. You know, it's a nice move to actually have, if unless you have an electric type Pokemon right here. So, avoiding all the grass areas, let's see, I don't think there's, oh wait, there might be something else right here. I don't even know. Okay, so, let's see, avoiding, time to battle. Alright, so, you know what? Yeah, off screen I did train my bone saw a little too. Well, didn't really train, I just captured Pokemon and it happened to grow levels from time to time. So, we're going to be using bone saw right here and showing off its strength. Look at that, Psychic Robert wanted to come out with the Solosis. Alrighty, let's go Bonesaw. Look at that, his Pokemon looks majestic. And yes, we finally grew it to level 22. Again, Pokemon trainers here. You can actually grow your Pokemon quickly by just capturing as many Pokemon as possible. It kind of reminds me of another game, you know, something that is probably in a preview or is probably in a, you know, in the, in the works and all that stuff. <clears throat> Pokemon Go, you know, that kind of stuff. And look at that, Dragon Rage. And good old Bonesaw wins his first official battle right here on screen. I'm happy. I'm very, very happy. Okay, so let's see. Let's move on right here. More Pokemon trainers on the way. And here is a teacher. Why are you moving around? Like, why are you... Yeah. They're just stones, right? They probably are. I don't even know. So here we go. Going up against Tourist Fumiko coming with her skip loom right here. And it's looking all too scary. And here we go, Bonesaw. It's the Bonesaw, Bonesaw Show featuring Bonesaw, the Axu right here, and Red Basket. Completely forgot that this Pokemon actually knows Fairy-type moves, and I forgot that dragons are, yeah, kind of, yeah, are kind of, uh, what was it, uh, weak to Fairy-types, especially in this game now, since it got introduced and all that stuff, so. There we go, Slash Attack for the win! Take that, Skip Loom. Alrighty, okay. And look at that, Aaliyah grows to level 27. Unfortunately, Bonesaw gets a little poisoned right there, so we're gonna be switching out our Pokemon, and here she comes out with a Dunspar, so let's go right ahead and take out Gaia 3. Now, again, like I was saying, guys, uh, I was actually trained. All the training that I was doing for my Pokemon, it was just capturing Pokemon. And, you know, in this game, it is introduced by capturing Pokemon, you get more experience points, which is awesome. And if you guys want to know what exactly it is that I'm doing, that's right, what's going on here? Oh, right. Yeah. 
Uh, the thing that I'm doing right here is I'm trying to capture as many Pokemon as possible, and more than likely I'm capturing like seconds and triples of Pokemon right here because I want to send them over to I want to send them over to Pokemon Sword and Shield, which, as many of you guys already know, it might be the next game that we will, we will be showcasing here uh, once Pokemon X is completed. I'm just saying. I'm transferring as many Pokemon as possible because, you know, I played these games many, many times. And uh, you should see my Pokemon bank. It's filled with different kinds of Pokemon, which is cool. Now, I get it. Many of you guys who've already played Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield are saying you can capture these Pokemon in the game. Well, there are certain ones, and there are certain Pokemon that I want in their first evolutionary line. So I kind of want to evolve them in there and just fill up my Pokedex. So, yes, yeah, you know, like a... Uh, it's a it's it, it's assuming if I want to be very specific with how I want to do things with Pokemon. So there you go, Azumarill getting its butt kicked. Everybody else gaining levels. Guy at three learning heal pulse right here. What is this heal pulse? Let's see heal pulse. Uh, the user emits healing pulse, which restores targets HP by. Hey, we could all, we could always use that for uh, what was it for double battles, but. Yeah, I definitely don't want to don't want to learn uh, heal pulse right now. And look at that, Fumiko has been defeated. Yes, sir. Okay, alrighty. So first thing is first, gotta heal my Pokemon. So let's see, antidote. Always fill yourself up with antidotes, and of course the usual plant slash jet is just like crossing and everything. Alrighty. So, let's go right ahead and cross this area right here. Wait, 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 hold on. What does this uh, sign say? Uh, let's see. Tap a player's icon. Yeah, tap a player's icon on the PSS. Then tap the name to, uh, the, to check that profiles. Oh, okay, well, if you guys don't know, my profile is down there. I will show you guys right now on how to find me online if, uh, if you guys are trying to find me. Let's see. Hold on just a sec. I'm looking at profile right here. And it says right there, the message will be saying, Gym Leader Draven. So if you guys want to find me and all that stuff, I will be... Well, that's how you're going to find me. Uh, more than likely, I might not answer because I'm probably doing a recording right here. So let's see. Actually, actually, I don't want to do that right now. Uh, let's go ahead and register our other... Let's go ahead and register our other stuff. Onto this... Uh, Onto this uh, thing right here, register. We got dowsing machine because there will be some hidden items around this area. So here we go. That's right. Got two guns right here, and uh, there's an item right there. And freaking oh my god! So we're getting attacked by a Pokemon, and one of those Pokemon it happens to be Schnubble. And I'm gonna have to capture you later on, I think. Yeah, I thought I captured it. So I'm gonna have to skip out on this Pokemon right here because. You know, not really part of the team. Now, here's an item. We found ourselves a mine plate. And uh, let's see. Can't see anything else, but there is something right there on the on the area. Okay, so moving on. A few years back, this really strange dude named Colris told me that these big stones emit some kind of special energy. Now, if you guys don't remember or don't know. We still haven't gotten there yet, but Colrus is uh, event he's the eventual bad guy for Pokemon Black Black and White 2, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think we've seen him somewhere. And look at that, we found ourselves a Gola, a pretty cool Pokemon. Pretty good typing and all that crud. So what I'm gonna do right now, I'm gonna have to put on a repel because I don't want to mess with any of these Pokemon right now. I mean, it's tempting. Trust me, guys, it is tempting to try and capture all these Pokemon here, but, yeah, that's not part of the plan. And it's the off-screen thing, that's what's going to have to go, so, let's see, there is something right here. Let's see, where the heck are you? I'm trying to find it. The heck? Okay. It's right here somewhere. Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, so, you know what, screw it, I'm wasting time, let's just move on right here. Let's go ahead and continue on our adventure right here. Now, when you step forward right here, you got a guy from Team Flare just blocking the way. Stop right there. I remember you. You're the one who followed our fo fo fossil finding plants. And now you're here standing around these stones. Do you have any idea what they even are? Of course you don't. You don't know nothing about the legend of 3,000 years ago, that says. 
Wait, what does that? What, what does it say? Oh, whatever. Who cares about it? About it all? Uh, all of that. It's time for me to get some sweet revenge with style. Okay, and he's gonna do his pose right here. Okay, so here we are, guys. Battling the team grunt again. Oh, the one with the hound hour. Okay, alrighty. So let's go. That's right, my good old buddy Bonesaw ready to kick some butt. And yes, we're gonna be going with some dual chops right here. So Bonesaw. Look at that. Its attack is through the roof, guys. It's unbelievable how strong this Pokemon is. And look at that. Rose to level 23. Freaking awesome. Look at that. And he's going to be coming out with a gold bat, so I got the cure for that. Let's go with our good old buddy Aaliyah right here. Now, off screen, I, I, while I was capturing some Pokemon, I actually happened to use uh, Sparky, the other Pikachu that I have. I was growing its level, so don't worry, guys. All these Pokemon are getting their leveling up and all that crud. It makes it so much easier to just pick around teams and stuff. And look at that gold bat. Defeated. There we go. And Godzilla grows to level 30. And, well, look at that. Beaten with smile. Alrighty. That looked pretty good with the, with, with the new threads right here. And, let's see. What the? How could I lose to a little punk like you? What are you, some kind of trainer prodigy or something? And he's getting a message right here. What the heck is going on? I see. Roger that. <laughs> Gotta love the Holocaster. I can uh, I can get updates on my mission in real time with stylish with the stylish device. Whoever thought the, thought this thing up must have been one truly stylish individual too. And on that note, it's time for me to scram with style. Okay, all right, well. Okay, so uh, that that right there with style. Okay, so let's go go ahead and grab this and got ourselves the X accuracy. And well, let's see. Yeah, we're gonna use another repel, but we're trying to locate some items right here. Right here, okay. Oh, damn. They're really... Okay, it's right here. There we go. I was about to say, they're making it hard for me to just find all these items right here. And there's one right there, so... Right... There we go. Right here, we found ourselves a burn heal. Okay, so... Let's move on right here. Let's see. Who? Okay, so there's no items right here, but there will be some Pokemon trainers, and I think maybe one more Team Plasma or Team Gal not not Team Galactic, but Team Flare guy. So let's see what this kid has to say. There are more and more of these big rocks as you get closer to Geosense uh, Town. Hmm. Really, Geosenge, Geosenge, and yes, I'm gonna put on another repel right here, and we're gonna get attacked by this guy. I can feel the energy of these stones enhancing my uh, already potent Psychonate powers. Okay, so let's go. Psychic Saeed wants the battle, coming out with a Metatite right here. And here we go with some Bone Saw. Okay, alrighty, so Slash Attack. I'm really loving Bone Saw's strength right here. Pick the right Pokemon, or I got lucky with like the right nature for this Pokemon right here. Look at this. That's right, now he's coming out with a Curlia, so let's go ahead and switch out to Kakashi Hitake right here. Ready. And willing and able and all that crud. And look at that, Kakashi. Look at all badass and everything. And Curlia using the trace, getting its torrent. But guess what? Kakashi Hitake. Ready to use some water pulse right here now. I was going to use that Lick Attack, but I remembered that ghost type Pokemon are not effective against fairy types. And uh, yeah. And look at that. Aaliyah grows to level 28. Saeed has been defeated. And there we go, another victory. Okay, so let's go ahead and find some more items right here. There's definitely gonna be more items to find, and look at that, we found ourselves a Thunderstone. Probably gonna be using it on the Pokemon pretty soon here. And let's see, well, no items, but there is a Team Flare guy up ahead. And well, let's go ahead and just take this person on. Can't you see we adults are busy? Don't interrupt our work, kid. Okay, look at that, look at that, look at that. So it's the same team uh, Flare Grunt that we've battled before, and here she comes out with Electric. Looking all mean and everything, so here we go. Let's get it. Uh, definitely don't want to get physical, so let's go with the Dragon Rage right here. And here's that quick attack, nothing too big, and here we go. 
Dragon Rage, and oh my god! I was about to say, well, that Rocky Helmet almost worked on us, but it was always fun. And look at that. That's right. Okay, so he's coming. She or she's coming out with a Krogon. So let's go with Gaia Three. Let's take care of business right now. Alrighty, alrighty. So here we go. Curlia looking all badass and everything. Close to evolution, by the way. While I was a uh, when I was capturing different Pokemon, I was like, yeah, I don't think it would be a good idea for what the hell is going on. Yeah, I don't think it would be a good idea to you know, capture Pokemon off screen while Curly was on the team because chances are it might evolve and yeah, I was, yeah, that was a, a good move right there because look at that, level 26, Gaia the Fierce Knight, four more levels away and there we go, no more, okay, alrighty, let's do that, let's do that, okay, so let's see, what does she have to say? Is discovering the secrets of these stone really a job for adults? Pretty much is. I mean, they're all around. And, well, I'm going to use another repel because definitely don't want to get attacked by any Pokemon right here. And, well, nothing's going on right now. There's a few Pokemon trainers here in left and right. So, let's go face them. Oh, wait, this is not a trainer. People in ancient times must have been incredible. Hmm. Maybe I should say that it was a Pokemon in ancient times that were incredible. Incredible. They probably were. And I thought I was done with Team Flare, but no, we got another person here. You inspect the stones, I inspect you. Okay, we're ready. Okay, let's do this. Going up against Team Flare, and she, of course, has a Gulpin. Just one Gulpin right here. I think, uh, huh. I think this was the one that we faced over at the, at the cave, probably. So let's go. Dual chomp. Oh damn, this Gulpin. Super strong with, with the, de the defense. And here comes that sludge attack. And of course, we're gonna get poisoned yet again. Bonesaw is, uh, yeah. Yeah, it, we, 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 need a, we need to increase its, uh, its health just a little bit. So here we go. Dragon Rage for the win. Okay, alrighty, look at that. And Kakashi grows to level 31. I predict that our Pokemon will be evolved, fully evolved by the time we hit the, well, the next town, I want I want to say. I don't even know. Okay, so, again, looking for some treasures right here. And, yes, we're going to be using another Repel. And, well, first is first. we got to heal our Pokemon. We can't just, uh, yeah, we can't just, uh, whatchamacallit, uh, have our Pokemon all messed up and everything, so... Here we go, another antidote for bone saw, and let's go ahead and use that super potion. And let's go ahead and start battling some trainers right here. To have a battle at a famous sightseeing spot, oh, this will make a, for a great memory. It is a great memory, isn't it? So here we go, another tourist, and her name is Tamako, coming with their, uh, what was it? Uh, wait, 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 a what the fuck, what the fuck are they, okay, a Drifloon, my bad. Alright, Ghost-type Pokemon still, so here we go. Gonna pop that balloon, and here comes... Oh yeah, you're gonna get hurt because you're being physical with me. Oh yes. Thank the good old Pokemon God Arceus for that Rocky Helmet. And here we go. Dragon Rage for the win. Look at that. Look at that, we're kicking butt. Oh yeah, and here he comes out with a... Or she comes out with a Hippopotas. Don't need, still don't know how to say the name, but it's whatever. Hippopotas. And look at that. Hippopotas. Hippop. Hippop Anonymous? Damn you, you give him the easy one. You guys know where that's from? Comment down below. <laughs> Hippopotas. Hippopotas. Okay, so I'm saying it right. I'm saying it right. I can't even say it right. God dang it. And look at that, Bonesaw, level 24, learning False Swipe. Now this is a good move if you want to actually capture Pokemon, because it actually leaves its target at 1 HP. Eh, I kind of don't want to use it right now, but I could go to the Pokemon Relearner eventually and just relearn it. If I want to capture some, uh, capture some legendaries and stuff. So I'm just going to keep my old moves, not that important, and well, I'm going to get hit by a Sandstorm, of course. So let's go, coming out with a Pachirisu, uh, so let's go with Gaia the Fierce Knight right here. 
Okay, alrighty. Alrighty. So, Pachirisu, getting ready to take on this uh, wannabe Pikachu Squirrel, and it does have Run Away. And, well, let's get this with a Confusion Attack. And, well, yeah, the Pokemon starts first, but here we go. Confusion does its thing. And, well, we're going to get booked by the Sandstorm right here. So hopefully we can get this one more time. And here's an Endure attack. Really? So, yeah, I'm probably going to have to use a Super Repel right here. And, god dang it. Okay, we're just going to have to let the Sandstorm just finish this Pokemon off. So let's go ahead and use a Super Repel or a Super Potion right here. There we go, Gaia. Getting your Super Potion. Let's go. And a charm attack right here. Okay, so our attack full and look at that. Ray for the sandstorm. That was all on you right there. And well, getting hit by a sandstorm again. And bam. Bam. And we defeated Tamako. Yeah, buddy. Okay, so I think that was the last trainer. We don't really have anything else to do right here. So now we're going to be entering Geosense Town. And one thing you should know about Geosense Town is it, it, this is where all the legend and the lure comes from. Of course, I'm checking out all I could find right here. I'm going to do it all in one episode since we don't want to like waste time and touring and all that stuff. So as you can see, Geosense Town is a town of stones. So he's going to be walking away. And... There, there are a few things that you can actually find right here. Like, for instance, if you go right here, you won't be able to get out because there's a few people waiting on a tour. So let's see. And in conclusion, the stones in Route 10 are lined up too, so they connect to Geosense Town. Sutler City Gym Leader Grant is researching them, but much about these stones remains unknown. So you can't get out until you actually find that team player uh, person. And that is exactly what we're going to do. Just run straight to him and if you see right here hear this peep squeak team flare is going to use the stones on route 10 and a and a fantastic treasure to make everyone on our t team happy in this world the ones who have the power are the ones who who win with flare you mean like rick flare i don't know and would you look at that, our girlfriend serena she's like driven was someone from team flare just here now yeah he was here, but he isn't anymore, is he? And the only thing past here is a dead end. There's something very weird about Team Flare. There really is. There, there really is. Uh, they're the most weirdest. Uh, yeah, they're the most weirdest uh, criminal gang that I've I've seen so far. And well, look at that. It is a uh, yeah, an ancient artifact. Well, not really an ancient artifact. It's just a dead end right here. And well. I believe that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much it for this episode right here because that's the only thing we need to we need to take a look at. In the next episode, we're going to be going into the next route and well, actually, you know what? Screw it. We're going to get these items first and then we can sign off right here. So there's two items that we've located right here. And we found ourselves a timer ball, which is cool. And Let's see, there is something else that we can actually find right here. Find right here. So, let's see. Where is where? There's an item right here. Okay, so we grabbed this item. We found ourselves a soft sand. And, as many of you guys know, it actually helps any kind of ground type Pokemon. So, that is pretty much it for this episode. In the next one, we are going to be going, I believe, into the next... Uh, the next route plus, I guess, the, the mountainside area. Yeah, we're going to combine a whole bunch of stuff together, guys. So, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.